Hello, welcome to Studio Pixel Volkswagen Car Modeling in Maya Chapter 6. Fine, from the previous chapter we created this. Now just change the color of the uh, polygons select, uh, to blue so that I can uh, clearly see what is uh, going on with the background image. Fine, just to delete the history, select these two parts and just combine these two surfaces. So that we can uh, easily you know, merge the vertices. Fine. Fine. Just uh, merge the vertices and just increase the distance threshold 0 0.01. Okay. So <coughs> just uh, hide the other you know, uh, surfaces that I have created. Hide, unselect, not selected. Fine. Now readjust uh, the position of the vertex of the bonnet area. Fine. That's it. Cool. cool. So we. I can, you know, readjusting the vertex, and also it will clear to me where to put an extra edge if I really required. Just select the vertex and just scale it down so that it will be in the straight line. Okay, now uh, for this portion, I just uh, put another cut over here for insert edge loop tool, and I'll just. Uh, Reconstruction, reconstruct this area of the bonnet which is actually connected with the that's it fine. <coughs> okay, now the, the front part just uh, hide the rest of the surface, just select the middle vertex. And just pull it down gradually just uh, deselect the other vertex the surface flow is very important how your vertex is actually you know flowing towards the surface of the hard surface modeling fine just readjust uh, its position just let me check whether it's oh it's a big, big gap fine yeah. Just have to you know, adjust this uh, front vertex also. Fine. Select other one. Fine. That's it. Okay, and you just have to pull these vertex a little front side. Fine. Now you can see the surface has been, you know, uh, not in a very good position. So I have to uh, readjust the edges. So select the edges and just, you know, move the edges according to the uh, direction of the surface flow by transform component. Fine. Okay, now uh, move on to the uh, this window part. So just select those and uh, hide the, uh, other surface areas. Select the you know vertex <coughs> in this part. Just scale it down to the you know. Oops, I missed that. Okay, fine. So just scale it down to the window base of the window. So didn't miss that. Okay. Just select the uh, all the vertices. Just push it down to the base of the window. What is happening? Okay, cool, fine. Uh, now just uh, create uh, by split polygon tool. Just uh, you know, create the extra amount of cuts to get the shape of the the rounded corner of the window. Fine.
just scale it down also in the middle of the door just making this uh, uh, real simple and the flow of the software because uh, there is no curvature sh required over this area fine cool so just select these uh, faces and just duplicate this I'm uh, sorry extract this so that will be uh, window and I'm just make another layer saying window glass fine just save it cool now just hide those uh, window part and I'm just uh, constantly on this door so unhide and just to keep those uh, you know nerve surfaces in, within one window select the curves that I have took earlier just to you know uh, make the scene of the object look uh, simpler so just to add those fine now <coughs> I can concentrate on those uh, polygonal geometries now here you have to uh, very you know it's very tricky I'm just using this uh, technique to you know manually creating those uh, uh, surface flow like this you know though I, I can adjust those uh, edges or the vertices but I will prefer to you know uh, create those edges according to my existing surface flows so uh, so that you can easily understand what, what is actually going on and this actually really helped me a lot to you know uh, to create the surfaces in in a new way and not adjusting the existing ones so you can see uh, just deleting the old ones and just created the new surface flow according to my you know rooftop areas so that's it just select this extra what I see deleted and select the extra edge which is slanted I'm just deleting it okay okay so that's how I can I can really you know uh, create uh, I mean uh, uh, maintain those uh, surface flows the curve flows I have already created but uh, initially you can you feel that uh, well this this is uh, I mean what, what is the need of that I mean no need this is just another uh, no a practice uh, the way uh, where you can you can use it I mean I felt it uh, that it's really a uh, nice thing to do uh, so just uh, recreating the surface flows I mean the edges that you requires where you need because you already have those basic shape now I have just have to flow the uh, maintain the flow so that's why I found it really really you know cool to use this kind of uh, this approach so that's it now just uh, select this uh, rooftop and just merge those vertices by combining those two surfaces that's it merge you can, you can press G also same so that's it that's my surface that is uh, I mean I can just check the you know the normals of the faces just confirm it so that the every vertex every face should uh, you know face towards in the same direction so that's it and uh, thank you very much for this chapter we'll meet on the next chapter